Meat poultry birds like broilers need good nutrition for them to grow very fast and to enhance their immune system so as to prevent diseases. Interestingly, there's a simple powder that can be legally be used so as to enhance their growth and health. And this powder is called Meteorite. So on this video, I am going to follow this, you know, this protocol. I'm going to show you what is Medionine and why you should use it. Benefits of using Medionine. And I'm going to show you the experimental diet that you can use so as to make the diet that will contain Medionine. And I'm going to show you the results of the experiment that was done. And then you're going to conclude this video. And interestingly, this experiment was done during the few weeks you know the last week of production that is from day 42 to day 48 that is you know when this experiment was done so what is methionine methionine is an essential amino acid that is used in making poultry feed diets and many and methionine is necessary for body function immune system build up and to improve their performance and it has been found to improve the feed intake, body weight gain, you know, feed conversion ratio and the average weight, you know, weight gain. So the use of methionine in some countries is banned, you know, for the production of organic broiler meat. And this banning or reduction or rather elimination of methionine in organic broiler feeds could increase the feed cost and have a negative impact on the environment and also on the growth and health of the birds because this will make the birds eat more compared to when omelianine is used in feeds and we're going to see how that you know how that thing all how all that you know that thing happens so i'm going to show you this uh, this study and you're going to see the effect of burning amounts of omelianine in feeds and also i'm going you know i'm going to compare the you know the two feeds where whereby the omelianine was used and when omelianine was not used so what are some of the benefits of using methionine? Methionine, you know, methionine has several benefits. We have four of them. So the first one is that it improves the feed efficiency. Poultry cannot synthesize methionine on their own. So they rely on the data resources so as to meet this need of methionine. By supplementing their diet in methionine, farmers can boost the growth rate of their birds and improve the feed efficiency, which means the birds can produce more meat with less feeds. The second benefit is that, you know, methionine can enhance muscle development and yield. Methionine is a key building block for protein, which is essential for muscle development and tissue repair. By providing adequate methionine in their diet, farmers can ensure that their birds have a strong muscles and produce more meat per unit of body weight. The third importance is it strengthens the immune system. Methionine is also known as is also known for its capability to improve the immune system of poultry as it helps produce antibodies and other immune cells that can protect the birds from diseases and infections. By giving their birds enough methionine, farmers can reduce the risk of illnesses and improve the overall health of frogs. The third and um, now the final benefit is the fourth one is that it you know the balances it balances the amino acids. Methionine is considered the first limiting amino acid, you know, in corn soybean based poultry diets, which means that most likely that it will be deficient and the limiting, you know, and this will limit the growth and productivity of birds. By supplementing the diet with methionine, farmers can balance the amino acids profile in and ensure that the amino, all amino acids are present for the light, you know, the light amount, so that the birds can can be able to access this. So we are going to see the the you know the kind of feed that was used so that so you know, for this experiment. So we had three, you know, we had three researchers and they're using this kind of ingredients over here. So you know, and and then now we have you know, not us to notice something very very interesting. On the amount of methionine, you can see that the first researcher had uh, 0.16, uh, whereas now the second researcher had a higher methionine level. And also, uh, also I also want us to notice something about the methionine. 
you can see that the that decided did not put any methionine in the feed. So what happened? What happened? What did happen? What is the impact of methionine? So the first thing that I'm going to go through is the growth performance of methionine. So you're going to see the weight gain and the feed intake also a good the feed commercial ratio and remember that the second researcher had the highest amount of methionine in the diet and you can also see that the it you know he also had the highest weight gain compared to the two kind of feeds and also the kind of feed intake it was lesser compared to these two other researchers and also a different on the feed commercial ratio we have seen that the second researcher, the kind of diet that he prepared, which had the highest amount of methionine, you know, is the feed, you know, this, that feed was, you know, had the highest feed conversion ratio for the chickens. So it seems that methionine is increasing the feed conversion ratio for the birds, and that is very, very good because we don't want to waste our feed. So the birds will be able to eat less feeds as we have seen in the kind of feed intake. And remember that these are in grams. And you can see that I've told you that the, you know, this was done from from the final days, and this and that was 48 to yeah was 43 to 49 days of age. And you can use this, you know, you can increase the median level in the diet, you know, from the beginning when you know when the birds are you know are day old until now when they are allowed to go to the market, you know. And this is this kind of experiment is giving us a view only on the only on the last few days, but you can experiment with the last few days so let us see what is the carcass yield what you know what is the capability of methionine in improving the weight of special you know on the parts of the chicken when the chicken is slaughtered and not us to take a look on the you know on the amount of breast that was present you know on the second diet i can say that it has the highest breast level but when you compare now to the rest of the legs wings you can see that they are almost equal in in that amount so you can see that the second diet which is highest in methionine had the highest amount of breast weight so if you are taking your you know so if you're taking your birds to the market that requires breast you know breast meat i think methionine supplementation will be paramount for you to get the highest value for your money so how do you conclude this video i conclude that this diet which you which you can screenshot the second diet i conclude that that farmers that raise birds for processing find it more economically beneficial to use diets with the highest and the higher amino acid level compared to those that sell whole birds. So if you are going to sell you know special these parts you can use methionine but you but when you sell the you know the whole bird at once you know without measuring the weight I think that will limit the way you get your money out of your, out of the investment of methionine and that actually applies more to all the cases uh, in terms of either you're using the natural additives yeah so this is because the amino acid diet produces more paste meat which, is, which has a higher market value and the synthetic amino acid lysine and methionine are relatively cheaper therefore it will be advantageous for broader farmers who make their own feeds to provide higher amino acid levels in their diet compared to feed manufacturers who produce and sell complete diets. So if you're going to make your own chicken feeds, I think you should consider making this making feeds to a higher methionine level and you can consult your potent nutrition expert on that case. So I hope that this video has able to open your mind on the impact of methionine in the broader diet and how that can help your birds in growing and enhancing their health. Click on the video in the screen now to learn how aloe vera can increase the weight of your birds.